to the Legend 2 coming soon to the Mid-South Coliseum. That's going to be big, my friend. I'm excited about that. And all my whole 15 years of being involved in wrestling, that was single-handedly the most exciting night I've ever had in the wrestling business. When all of the legends, we were talking about Sputnik Monroe, Jackie Fargo, yeah. the fabulous ones, the Rock and Roll Express. If you've been Lance Memphis, Russell was there. Dave, oh, for everybody, everybody was there. And they're all going to be back again. Coming up, we'll have more details. It'll be great. Yeah, we'll have details down the road. But, yeah, people, that if you've been around Memphis Mid-South Wrestling, if you've been a fan of uh, any years, you're going to see faces you haven't seen in a long time. Clash of the time. Legends 2. We'll be telling you more about that and announcing that date coming up real, real soon. I'm telling you, it was great. We had a big VIP party last yeah. time, so Memphis Wrestling Hall yeah. of Fame inductees, and we'll have all of that. But today, Too Cool 2 is going to be here next Dude. week. Thank you, George. Thank you, Curtis, for that. Let's get him out here with our Cash Depot fan cam, and let's kick it off today right here on Memphis Wrestling. Home of Rhythm and Bruce. the crowd they love them up there look at what they've got they got the title oh get that fire extinguisher out of here I'll tell you something Corey we got two things out with us out with us here today we got the southern tag team championship and we got this fire extinguisher right here that we used to cool those hot boys off and send them running back to Nashville crying to the mama <laughs> Now, we don't know, we don't know who we got next, but whoever it is, we're going to keep the Southern Tag titles, and we're going to keep it cool in Memphis, Tennessee. <laughs> oh, I like the look. Oh, boy. Look at here. We got Richard. What is he doing? Richard, oh, no. what are you doing, Richard? What is this all about? Hey, what are you doing with these clippers out here? If you didn't know, Corey, and a lot of you people don't know, Rashad Devon has a barber license, Jack. And as a matter of fact, I came here today to finish up some business that those other guys weren't able to compete, complete with you two idiots. They gave y'all a makeover, but they didn't get the job done quite right, Corey. So as of today, we're going to finish the job. What I'm going to do today, my guys are going to face you two guys in a hair versus hair match. What? In a hair versus hair match? Hair versus Wait a minute. You mean you're going to put the soul taker, wait a minute, and Coco's hair up against two cool dudes hair right here today? Yeah, Corey, because I got so much confidence in my guys. We had a couple weeks break. They've been working out, training hard. Wait a minute. First of all, you don't sign the matches around here, Richard. I don't know who told you you did. Are you saying you're challenging these guys to a hair match? I'm challenging these guys to a hair, a hair hey, match right here today. Rashawn, Rashawn, speak for yourself, man. You think I'm going to lose my beautiful hair, man, and, and everything? I got the best hair in Memphis, Tennessee. Coco, Coco. No. Hey. Man, what is wrong with my, this is my wig, man. Don't worry about it, brother. What's wrong with I got you? so much confidence, man. Don't worry about it. We got this, man. Wait, wait, wait. Rashad, I know you, and you slicker than a pork dog at a Jiffy Lube. <laughs> now, let me tell you something. Since you so sly and we know how you do business, what we want is you to get in the ring with them, Rashad, and whoever gets pinned, then they get their hair clip, clip, clip. <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. I said I had a barber license, not a wrestling license, Jack. I'm going to put my guys in the ring. Corey, I want to say this. I have the naturalest hair in the studio, the whole in Memphis. Everybody here has got weeded hair. The hair is not real. And I'm the, I got the only natural hair it is. And, and I can't believe it, Tashar. Hey, Coco, I'm so confident in you guys. If we, if y'all lose the match, I'll even let you cut my hair or his hair or his hair or Brian, either one of you guys. I'm going to leave you these clippers right here. We can talk about this in the back, man. All right, so let me understand this. No, wait, don't go to the back yet. Let's let all these people understand that are home watching here today. You want a hair versus hair. Hey, get this Watch stuff out. away. Watch it. So taking Coco's hair, I'm telling you, on the line against two cool dudes, hair right here today, and whoever loses gets their head shaved right here on TV in the middle of the ring. Somebody's getting their hair cut right here today, boy. You got hey, it. Hey, there is somebody getting their hair cut today because that 
is the business now. Well, we got a hair match coming up today. Stay tuned. We weren't looking for that one. Wait, 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 wait. That wasn't on the schedule, but uh, makes it interesting. Oh, Dad. He got what he asked for. Dad, everything else. What, Coco? What? Is Rashad getting in the ring, too? Rashad's in that ring, too, so it's going to be a handicap match. And you may lose that natural today. We'll be right back. Oh, my. We're going to print next month. Oh, baby! Harper's new book is almost out, and it could ruin everything. Morris Chestnut, Nia Long, and Kevin Hill's Tay Diggs in The Best Man. Saturday night at 7, only on UPN 30. Has the rising cost of health insurance left you without protection? You're not alone. Effective immediately for as little as $129 a month, your family is eligible for a quality association health plan that can drastically reduce the cost of doctor visits, hospital stays, accident coverage, emergency rooms, even vision and dental, plus a powerful prescription plan. You can't be denied, and it's so easy to enroll. For small children, we need to see the doctor often. With the plan I chose, now I can afford to. I'm self-employed. When I broke my arm, the bill was $1,800. With the Select One Accident benefit, my portion was only $100. I'm on a fixed income. With my plan prescription card, I save on my name brand drugs and generics. I even save money on my glasses. Plus, I can have a qualified physician evaluate my health records, ask me questions, and prescribe medicine over the phone. Join today and use your doctor, dental, and prescription benefits immediately. All ages accepted. You can't be denied. Call now. Memphis Area Teachers Credit Union has always held the education profession in the highest esteem. After all, our future depends on the quality of education that our children receive. We wanted to create a program to support the people who develop our future, the teachers. Together with Eyewitness News, we're proud to sponsor one class at a time. Over the next year, we will award a $500 monthly grant to teachers to help with classroom needs. If you are a teacher in need of supplies, tools, or academic enrichments, then please let us know. Fear Factor, five days a week. Get your daily dose of fear. Fear Factor, weekdays at 3 on UPN 30. Welcome back. Listen to the sound of this. Can you hear that? Oh, that's a nice right. You're telling me, live here, someone's losing their hair today? Someone Guaranteed? Going to get the head shaved today. That's kind of unusual here to have a hair mat. Oh, my. You know what? started today i've already got a minor headache a major headache and i gotta put up with these two goose what is it now hey mr brian come over here man i don't want to give that little brother because now you know it's early in the morning but last night i noticed precious didn't come home to 4 30 this morning and when he came home this morning and i looked out in the driveway i seen a black uh delati delati new car dropping him off now i don't know what the deal was but I don't know but one person around here got a black Delati. That's not a Yukon. <laughs> and I think him and, I ain't gonna call no name, but I think him and Corey went out on a date last night. Oh, that's just absurd. I got it, we're gonna have a match here in a minute. Are you gonna be a part of this match? Yeah, <laughs> yeah we're gonna be part of the match. But see, don't be over there looking all puzzled at Corey Macklin. You know probably the person got a got a, a mean streak down his back. And you know if you don't act right, he'll come over there and slap slob out of your mouth. Hey, you come up if you want. That's the worst looking snag of two blue punk I ever seen. Get him in the ring, Randy. Let's go. We don't want to hear that stuff. Get right. to the ring. All right, right then. We're going to get in the ring. We know we got a mess, but check this out. Later on today, I bought a lot of, I bought a lot of TV time for private precious. So we don't spend like a million dollars to do a new segment. It called Precious Beauty Shop. I, I want you little that. brothers to look at it. I saw that on here. I hadn't seen what? that yet. I don't know what, what is that. Is. I don't know what don't that know. is. Let's ring the bell. Let's get on with you it. You know, it's one thing to kind of be like that, but to be snagged too, but think you're cute out here walking around. What Boy, a I'm mess. You here we go. Mitchell Vital and ABC Kid. ABC Kid with... got a new look today, Corey. ABC Kid. Yeah, ABC Kid looking good look over there. That. Mid-top idol, and, uh, well, we'll get this action underway from 
private fight and private precious. Crowd yeah. loving this. I saw on the format that there's something coming up. Later today, it's called Precious's Beauty Shop. Precious at the what Beauty in the Shop. World? I don't know. Uh, Bell sounds, here we go. I saw that on the format when I got in this morning. And I don't know uh, what that is. It, it's just, you know, like I said, we're just getting started today. And uh, boy, great to have you along. We'll see. We've got a good match here. We've got the ABC Kid, Mid South Idol with a private first class. I don't know about uh, first class. Private fine. Look at Private, private Precious, Precious dancing and prancing around there. He's doing it just to annoy you, I think. Mitch of Idol back into the turnbuckle. Fans chanting for the Idol and Private Precious. Oh, look at Precious rubbing it all over him. See, that's just ridiculous. We don't want to see that stuff out here. Trying to fill all on the guy and rub his face and stuff. Bill Rush says that's, that's enough. That's the craziest stuff. You know, you, you know what? We talked about earlier the Clash of the Legends coming up. One name that has been mentioned are the legends that wrestle, Brian. I don't know if you remember Exotic Adrian Street. You yes. Adrian Street? Yeah. Well, that's what this guy yeah. reminds me of. I sure do. We better hope if Exotic Adrian Street shows up at the Coliseum that he and Precious won't be partners. Yeah, Boy, that'll be not. a sight to behold, won't it? Precious is beauty shop. We'll be seeing what that's about. What it, what they bought that? the time. Yeah, they purchased the well, time here on Memphis Wrestling. They did put up some, some bucks. They put up, not only bucks, they had to pay cash because they didn't put, trust a checker. <laughs> not even certified bonds from Private Fine and Private no. Precious. They paid cold, hard cash for that one. Look at this. Nice kick from the midtown idol, and down he goes. A bell rung somewhere. Two count. Two's all he's got. Man, the bell rung on Private Precious' head. Didn't know where he was. What a main event we got. Climbing the rope. What a main event we got today, fans. Stay tuned. Coming up, it's going to be Hair versus Hair. Big oh. kick from ABC Kid. There must be a winner. Hair versus Hair coming up a little bit later. Two cool two against Coco Beware. Two count. Oh, and Precious kicked out. Coco Beware, Soul Taker, and Rashard. Rashard's in the ring, and whoever's pinned loses their hair right here today. That's, that's going to be a head shaving. It's been a while since we've had a hair match. That's Whoa, Bulldog. Down he goes. One this. Oh, yeah. Rashard might be one of those conditions where he wished he'd not open his mouth, Corey. We got a tag, and in comes Private Fine. Uh, private first class. Doubling up on him. Yeah, big right hand nails him, picks him up. Body slam as he drops the ABC Boy, kid. He threw him around like this. Uh, uh, oh, is, come on. Oh, I lay it private fight. He's laying back. Laying back, relaxing. He felt like he had him on one, two, three. He looked He's confident. Complaining to referee Bill Rush. Fans in ABC. Oh! And private first class fine. Doesn't catch anybody that time. Mid South Idol takes over after the tag. He raked the eyes. eyes again. Whoa, I'll tell you what else, Brian, we're going to do today. I saw the fan in the audience here, Grady Watson. I saw Grady up here earlier. Is he here? Two count. Two's all he's got. You know what happened last week with that despicable right. display, display by Jerry Lawler? I'm going to talk, see if I can get a hold of Grady during one of the breaks and get him down here and talk to him. And let's get his take from the fans. I'd love to hear what happened with Jerry Jerry Lawler. the King Lawler, in my opinion, at his lowest point with that fan. I'm telling you. Look at Precious and the idol out now from Providence Precious. Jerry Lawler's got words. We'll be hearing from Jerry the King Lawler today. Mouth of the South, Jimmy Hart. Oh! Sent in another interview also. We'll be in from him, but look at Precious. Precious in trouble. This could do it. Mid-South Idol going after him. Uh-oh, we're going to have a couple matches going look on. Look at Idol right on top of Private Precious. Ah, uh, and Precious. That's it. One, two, three. Yeah, Private Precious gets the one, two, three. They're trying to leave as fast as they can. One, two to 
three count with their feet on the ropes that time. And yeah, that's the exactly. wind goes to private, fine, private pressures. Take a break. All right. When we were younger, we didn't care about the price of prescription drugs. But somewhere along the way, I developed diabetes. And now we're very concerned about the price of prescription drugs. In fact, I know someone who had to choose between buying food or the prescription drug they really needed. Yes, that's why we'd like to tell you about Free Medicine Direct. If you're not covered by insurance, you might be eligible to get all your medications free. That's right. All your prescription drugs. Absolutely free. Drugs like Lipitor, Glucophage, Celebrex, and even Viagra. I know it's hard to believe, but this is the real deal. And if you spend more than $50 a month on prescription drugs like we do, then you should call now to see if you're eligible. So I have a medical condition that cost me about $200 a month in prescription drugs. I was feeling overwhelmed. Then I saw an ad for free medicine direct. I called right then, and now all my prescriptions are free. I don't know what I would have done. I was prescribed a medication that I couldn't possibly afford without free medicine direct. I just don't understand how people without a prescription plan could possibly afford their own prescriptions. I don't know how people get by without this program. Yes, I know it's hard to believe, but you may be able to get all your prescriptions totally free. Drugs like Lipitor, Glucophage, Celebrex, and even Viagra. All your prescription drugs. Absolutely free. If you're not covered by insurance, you might be eligible to get all your medication free. You should call now to see if you're eligible. Find out if you or your family are eligible to receive all your medications free. Just call this toll-free number right now. Six million Americans already received free medications. Why not you? Call now. To order, call 1-800-335-9190. That's 1-800-335-9190. So call 1-800-335-9190 now. Well, I'll tell you what wow. I want to do here now, Brian. Let's talk what? about uh, coming up. Have we got the graphic for the Country Ford main event that's coming up a little bit later today? Hair versus hair. There it is. It's going to take place today. Hair versus hair. There must be a winner. It's going to be two cool two taking on the team of Coco Beware, Soul Taker, and Richard. And whoever loses the fall gets their head shaved right in the middle of the ring. Right here today on TV. Brian. Country Ford main event, and it will happen. And we didn't know when we came in today that we'd have this match. But they, someone opened their mouth out here. You saw who it was, and they may regret it. Yeah, speaking of big mouths and opening their mouth, Jimmy Hart. Oh. <laughs> Corey Macklin, the wannabe. You know what, Corey? You've always wanted to be a legend. You've always wanted to be a superstar. You've never been content with just being an announcer. Corey, do you ever think that you're going to be like Jerry the King Lawler in the mouth of the sound Jimmy Hart? In the immortal Austin Idol? Or handsome Jimmy Valiant? Or all the superstars that came through Memphis? It's never going to happen, baby. You're never going to have action figures out like Jimmy Hart's had out. Never in your lifetime. You are never going to be on the cover of a WWE magazine along with the immortal Hulk Hogan. It's not going to happen in a lifetime, baby. And most of all, you see, you've never going to have a million-seller album out like Jimmy Hart's had with the Gentries. Keep on dancing. Cinnamon Girl. But you know what's going to happen to you, Corey Macklin? I'm going to tell you. I'm bringing in right now my official bodyguard. My bodyguard. A man that was one time, four times the WWE heavyweight champion of the world in tag teams. Four times, WCW, Tag Team's Champion of the World. My good buddy, Brian Knobs, <laughs> nasty boy. That's right, that's right, Corey Macklin. I'm bringing a cane just for you, pal. Don't you know what's happening? Don't you know what you did by laying your stinking hand what? on the greatest manager that ever lived in professional wrestling? You screwed up, brother. You screwed up big time. So here's the cane, but you're not going to need a cane because you're going to be in a wheelchair, buddy. Let me tell you, you're going to take that trip down Nasty Boulevard, baby, and we're going to see if you can handle Pity City, Please, baby. Man,
Oh, ho, ho. That's coming your way, Corey Mathen. Can you dig that? Hey, hey, you know what, oh, Nobs? What's that, you know what? I think we ought to put the band back together again. Oh, yes. Jerry oh, yes. the King Lawler. Jerry, Jerry the King Lawler oh, yes. lead vocals. Oh, yes. Coco Beware oh. back in the band. Richie Be Fine back in the oh, band. Yeah. I need to re enlist Shock once again. Oh, you know what? Why don't we go out by playing my million seller, Cinnamon Girl? Play, Play it, it, brother. Play it. Oh, yeah. Keep it going, baby. I'm getting ready oh, to yeah. sing it, baby. Sing it to me. Let's hear that great vocal. Here we go. I wanna live with a cinnamon girl. I can be happy for the rest of my life with the cinnamon girl. How's that That's better than the backseat boy, Jimmy? You're in sync. Our pictures are running the night. Oh yeah. Cormac love would be you for anything oh, in my well. life. A cinnamon girl. Oh, oh yeah. Back. Keep it going, baby. We're on our like way. It. We're putting the band back yeah. together. King, I can't wait to get back oh, to yeah. Memphis, baby. <laughs> Oh, sing it. You sound like Elvis, baby. You're singing like Elvis. I am so I, I know you are. Corey Mackin, you're finished. We're running you out of town, Big Daddy. <laughs> yeah. Yes, yes, oh, yeah. Yes, yes. Sing it, Big Daddy. Yeah. All right. There's someone who is living in the past. That record's about 35 years old. I'm tired of hearing it play. Jimmy Hart talking about he sold a million seller record. Well, he didn't have anything to do with it. Remember a guy named Larry Raspberry? Absolutely. That old thing yes. with centuries. He did it. And what about Brian Nobbs? His belly done left about four times over his daggum belt out here talking about what he's going to do. Bring the nasty boys down. You bring whatever oh, yeah. you want, Jimmy Hart. We're here. We're right here in Memphis with all these great people here in Memphis, Tennessee with Memphis Wrestling, Jimmy Hart. And we're going to be here. When the smoke settles and the dust clear, we'll be here. You bring those. As a matter of fact, why don't you bring them for the Clash of the Legends? I know a lot of people that'll take care of them, like the Rock and Roll Express, Absolutely. like the Fabulous One. Maybe we'll see if we can hook that up coming up down here. A at good the idea. Coliseum. I'm telling you. You know, this whole thing has just got me just about up to here with Hart and Lawler and that whole thing. And I'm going to talk. To Grady, I, I saw him out here. Noise. We're gonna get him in a few moments out here. We're gonna talk to him. But right now, as we get ready to take a break, and we're gonna talk to Grady. Private Precious and Private Fine purchase some time. Precious is beauty shop. I don't know what this is. Just, just sit tight. Let's see. What if you want your hair and nails done, you come on down here to Gannis on here with Elvis Presley. That's where private presses work. I'm going to take y'all out there right now, you low budget. Now sit back and relax and watch this man just watch, just watch him do his work. Girl, did you see that girl at church Sunday with all that mess in her head and that little short, little hoochie mama dress on? Oh, mm -hmm. yeah, but did you see her, the one had the wig on? No, I didn't. I missed that. Got I'm too the busy. Sound and then they had number plastic on she her She had number plastic on her head. I'm too busy <laughs> looking at the, <laughs> at the ushers over there, girl. The men over there in tight suits. Yeah. Woo, baby, looking good. Mm, mm, mm. Mm. Ooh, 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 girl, I'm almost about to lose my religion over here. Man, those are some sexy men. You don't see them men, girl? Yeah, I saw them. You can't tell me you ain't want to go over there. I bowed my head in prayer. Oh, well, I had already <laughs> prayed before I got to church. <laughs> <laughs> girl, hold on. Let me, let me help you. Let me help you. You need some, you need some uh, spray, some uh, conditioner put in our girl. Oh, thank you. Mm-mm. Then them, them women sitting up there, the motherboard. Did you see the motherboard? Mm -hmm. With all them old big, big old ugly hats on. Girl, I sure needed one of them hats for my hair. Shoot. And try to wear these big real short and then put the handkerchief over their yeah, leg. Yeah, try to put the handkerchief over their leg like yeah. don't nobody want to see. <laughs> girl, I tell you what, come on, hold on, girl. Put this right down. Come on, let me let me help you with some of this. Let me let me help you with some of this moves to put in her hair. Chad, wait a minute, you put too much in there. Huh? See, you put, too, put too much in here. I put too much in there. Yeah, we need to go on over here to this bone and take uh, it down. Okay, come on, let's, let's put it over here. Let's take over here and put it over in the bone. Lord, have mercy. Look, look at me. I just, I just didn't mess myself up. Got all this white stuff on my lips and stuff. Oh. Come on, put the water. Oh, oh Lord, oh. have mercy. <laughs> Lord, how mercy. I'm sorry. Girl, did I get it all out? I believe I got it all out. I'm trying to get your hair right, honey. Precious, you huh? made a mess. Just go on with my hair. 
You done made a mess. Oh, 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 but I was trying to help you. You see kind of work private pressure do? Now, if you want your hair and your nails done, you just come on down here to Gannis over here on Elvis Presley Boulevard. That's the most ridiculous stuff I've ever seen. In I hope you got your cash for that. Man, do we get our money? that and talking about the church people and stuff. Go to break. We'll be back. We got action coming up in the ring. That six man still to come with the hair at stake. And coming soon, we got details about that right there on your screen. We'll be back. On the WB's Big Sunday, only two fresh episodes left of Charm. The Walking Dead. Like zombies? Are hunting a charmed one. They're trying to freak you out. But Phoebe's found a protector who can't protect her. Busy little bee. Fresh Charm. I slept with a zombie. Then, for this big time finale, Steve brings out the real charmed ones. The season finale of Steve Harvey's Big Time Challenge. After Fresh Charm. The WB Sunday, starting at 6 on UPN 30. You want to live life to its fullest. If you smoke, you're not. Today, thousands are turning to Smoke Away. Smoke Away is the all-natural, non-prescription system formulated to help you be smoke-free. The Smoke Away program is designed to help reduce and control nicotine cravings, minimize withdrawal symptoms, and help keep you calm. Live a smoke-free lifestyle. Call now or go online to try Smoke Away risk-free and live life to its fullest. Are you ready to quit smoking? You can get the help you need. Today, thousands are turning to Smoke Away. Smoke Away is the all-natural, non-prescription system formulated to help you be smoke-free. The Smoke Away program is designed to help reduce and control nicotine cravings, minimize withdrawal symptoms, and help keep you calm. Live a smoke-free lifestyle. Call now or go online to try Smoke Away risk-free and get the help you need to quit smoking. You just can't be the country made deal. Right now at Country Ford, fresh shipments of 04 and 05 Ford certified pre-owned cars and trucks are rolling in. Plus, Country Ford is now your Mercury certified pre-owned headquarters. Prices slashed to below market levels. Credit problems? No problem. But don't wait. See us now while selection's best. Whatever it takes. You just can't beat a country made deal anywhere. Stay tuned for an amazing free Stop Smoking offer. We quit smoking together. I don't think I could have stopped without it. I quit just like that. With maximum strength cigarettes, you will quit, guaranteed. I thought I was going to go nuts wanting a cigarette. I never did. Cigarettes was easy. It just worked. Other stop smoking methods can eventually cost you hundreds of dollars. But we're so sure cigarettes will work for you, we'll let you try it free. You get a 30-day supply of maximum strength cigarettes free, plus minty anti-craving gum. And we'll also send along a 30-day supply of smoker's vitamins. That's almost $100 of proven stop smoking power, free of charge. I did it for the family. The kids wanted me to stop smoking. Hey, do what I did. Pick up the phone and call this toll-free number. Call 1-800-406-0202 to order your free 30-day supply of cigarettes, your free 30-day supply of anti-craving gum and vitamins. Credit card required for shipping and handling. Call now. back on Memphis Wrestling. Thank you for joining us here today. It's going to be a big one today. We got that hair match still to come. I got the Clippers right, right here. And we're going to be doing the honor. Somebody loses their hair right here today on national TV. Boy, that's a feeling. Grady Watson, I saw him out here early. Can we get, where is, where is he? There he is. Grady, come on over. I want to tell. Let's give him, yeah. Nice round of applause for Grady Watson, one of our fans here. Grady. Welcome back to the studio. How are you, how are you doing? You feel okay? Doing fine. Well, good. Good. I saw, I saw what happened uh, on the match there in Walnut. As a matter of fact, we got some footage of that, uh, what took place. And I wanted to get your version, Grady, of what took place down in Walnut, Mississippi with Jerry Lawler right there. Well, first of all, Corey, he got, he got mad because I did defeat him here in, in my hometown. And he'd done some things to me, man. It was awful. I, it took me two or three days just to get over it. Yeah, I understand. Yeah, he had you busted open pretty good. That's where he fooled you right there and, and hit you with the microphone and the whole deal. And, boy, I'm telling you, it was, man, it was a sight to see. Yes, sir. I'm just glad you're okay and uh, doing well. I know that uh, uh, that that took a hold on you right there. There he is there. What is he doing? 
choking you there. And he basically, what did he bust you open? That microphone hit you and busted Yes, sir. He hit me over the eye with the microphone and busted my eye. And he got you right over, was it the right eye? Yes, sir. Left eye, right over that left eye, yeah. And right there, there he is, Lawler, just pounding away on you, just beating on you. And, you know, we heard his version here, Renee's version. And, you know, they were out here trying to run you down, Grady, and, and run down the whole entire family and all that stuff. Well, you know what? They're not done, I'm sure. I understand he's got some word. And Jerry Lawler is standing by, and I'm sure that little Renee is not far from him. So I, I wanted you to just stand here, and I still want to hear your side, okay? But stay right here and watch this with me. Let's see what Jerry Lawler's got to say. Well, Renee, we're back here on the show once again, and can you believe that Corey Macklin has claimed that this Grady Watson, who I had this huge match with, mm -hmm. the biggest thing that ever happened in the history of Walnut, Mississippi, Corey Macklin comes on here last week and claims that I beat up a poor, innocent, helpless fan. Now, is that not ridiculous? That is, that is really ridiculous. I mean, let's face it. <laughs> Grady Watson was a trained, seasoned, professional wrestler. He knew what he was doing. He challenged me to a match. He challenged me, right? Yes, he did. He challenged me to the match. And then once he gets his brains handed to him, he wants to cry. He wants to moan and groan and, and claim that he was just a fan. You know what I think he's trying to do? What? He's trying to build up for a big lawsuit. You know, I a mean. A lawsuit? A lawsuit, yeah. He because wants he has to... no money. Exactly. Exactly. And you can tell. How can you tell? Well, first of all, because he's from Mississippi. <laughs> exactly. His entire family. You know what was so funny? He claims that, uh, uh, he, you know, he's got this son named Timmy Watson and oh, a daughter Timmy. named Tammy, Tammy. Watson. Oh. Tammy. And they all just sat at ringside and watched their poor dad get beat up. What a close, tight-knit family they are, huh? That whole family is a bunch of liars and cheaters. And let me tell you something about, about that Tammy. Uh-huh. Okay, she is a stalker. A stalker? A stalker. Oh. She went around town trying to get my number so that she can call me up on the phone. Yeah. And she tried one time to bring me over a strawberry cake. A cake? Like I would ever, ever eat anything from Walnut, Mississippi. <laughs> I mean, come on. And what about Timmy Watson, his son? You remember what he did? He used to send us emails. He used to, he got my email address. Do, and you, know what, do you know what his email address was? What? It was T. Watson. Do you Timmy know Watson. Timmy for? Watson. What? T. Watson. Watson. Twatson, a creature. <laughs> His email only, address is Twatson. Only the Watsons would come up with something like that. You know what we need to do? What? We need to, um, I think we need to issue a challenge. Oh, definitely. I think you and I should challenge the entire Watson family, maybe everybody from Walnut, Mississippi. They're a bunch of But I'm going to tell you right now, I'm going to tell you what we're going to do. We're going to issue a challenge. Renee and me are challenging the entire Watson family. I'm sure there's a big clan of them. You come to TV, you come right up here to Memphis, come to the big city, and we will get you in that ring. You're all seasoned professionals. We'll get you in that ring, provided they sign a release, right? Yeah. <laughs> and then I'll tell you what, we'll show you why I'm the king and she is the new queen of wrestling. Did you know that I am dubbing you the new queen of wrestling? No. Yes, watch this. Look what I have for you, sweetheart. Look at this. Renee, I crown you the new queen of wrestling. Oh, thank you, baby. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's beautiful. Does it look pretty? Beautiful. Whatever. Oh, man. Yeah, whatever is right. Corey, Jerry thinks he's the, he loves to come out and talk about your family, okay? But do you know down in Walnut, Mississippi, his own family helped me win that match. Okay? Yeah, I'm from the South. I talk like I'm from the South. My whole family from the South, and we're proud of it. We're not ashamed of it. Well, Lawler, let me tell you something. Let's get something straight. You can come out here, you can talk about me, buddy. But when you talk about my kid, that fighting word. That's right. And you, Miss Cream, <laughs> yeah, my daughter, she isn't a gold digger. She ain't got a rich sugar daddy. <laughs> she ain't got a rich sugar daddy to put that golden diamond crown on over her head. But do you know what? She's a woman enough to whoop your Yankee butt all over this town. Whoa. Oh. Oh. Corey? Down in Mississippi, we got two things. We got a saying. You know the difference in a Yankee and a damn Yankee? What's the difference? A Yankee come down here and visit and then go back. 
a damn Yankee come down here and stay just like Renee. Whoa. Huh. I tell you one thing, he's got Grady a little hot under the collar. Let's get ready to take a break. He's right. He's not only, he's, I don't know if you can call Lola a sugar daddy or a cake man. I don't know what it is, but it's one or the other. We'll be back. That whole thing's a mess. <laughs> Unity of the Spirit, Sunday mornings at 6.30 a.m. on UPN 30. Lord, we need your mercy, Starting over? Start right with Williams Furniture, where you'll always save. Three-piece sofa set. $199. Coffee and two end tables. $69.97. Four-piece bedroom suit. $199.97. Five-piece dinette. $119. Day bed with trundle and two mattresses. Three nineteen eighty eight. Bunk beds with mattresses. Two forty nine ninety seven. Complete twin bed. One fifty four eighty eight. Williams Furniture, the best price is guaranteed. Twenty eight seventy eight Old Austin P Highway. Has the rising cost of health insurance left you without protection? You're not alone. Effective immediately for as little as one hundred and twenty nine dollars a month, your family is eligible for a quality association health plan that can drastically reduce the cost of doctor visits. Hospital stays, accident coverage, emergency rooms, even vision and dental, plus a powerful prescription plan. You can't be denied, and it's so easy to enroll. For small children, we need to see the doctor often. With the plan I chose, now I can afford to. I'm self-employed. When I broke my arm, the bill was $1,800. With the Select One Accident Benefit, my portion was only $100. I'm on a fixed income. With my plan prescription card, I save on my name brand drugs and generics. I even save money on my glasses. Plus, I can have a qualified physician evaluate my health records, ask me questions, and prescribe medicine over the phone. Join today and use your doctor, dental, and prescription benefits immediately. All ages accepted. You can't be denied. Call now. I've been waiting for this, Corey. Uh-huh, we've been I talking didn't about see it. This. When I came here today, I didn't see this coming. But I'm looking forward to this. I'm telling you, it should be a dandy. Let's go to the ring. Referee Jerry Calhoun is standing there. And, oh, boy, that's Rashad Devine. What has he got on? What is What is he world? wearing? What is that about? Now I guess he thinks he's Jackie Chan or somebody out here kicking it. Bruce Lee or something. He's got Coco rubbing that natural he's got, but... He may lose, you may lose that natural today, Coco, I tell you that. Well, he just have to get you some nair is all I can tell you. Maybe it'll grow back. But somebody is losing their hair right here today on TV. It's Rashad Devon, Coco Beware, and Soul Taker. And on the other side, it's Too Cool 2. that fire extinguisher. Yeah, they Watch got it. a little extra ammunition for them, and they need it with the other three on the other side. This one's going to go to the expiration of our time. We've got plenty of time for it. Somebody is losing their head, and they couldn't be Tim or Flex, the one or two good, too. I'm telling you, It'll when you something. look on the other side and see these other three snakes in the grass, it's a possibility that uh, one of these guys will lose their head. Whoever's pinned will lose their hair right here today on TV. The referee Jerry Calhoun's in there. You picked a great day to be watching. Memphis Wrestling, good to have you along. All right, Calhoun says, do it, do it. You can't do it, let me do it. Here we oh, go. <laughs> Too cool, too. I kind of a handicap match here. Handicap match. Man, Shannon Flex. Does anyone want to tell Rashad how ridiculous he looks? Oh, yeah, Rashad. He looks like a reject offer of a football team or something. Somebody that was cut. That's what right. he looks like. Uh, oh, he got his pants outside of his pants. He got some old pants on and tennis shoes. 
Oh, but he's got a big guy in there on his side now. There's Big Soul Taker. Yeah, well, we'll see. Better be looking the and other if direction. If the Soul Taker loses, he take that mask off, and we'll see what kind of hair he's got on that That's hand. That's right. I've got a feeling it ain't too pretty either, Brian, because he wouldn't. The old saying is you don't oh. cover up what you like, you That's know? That's right. Whoa, drop kick and staggers. And finally gets that big. Got down a two count and Soul Taker. That was almost a very quick match. Yeah, right but there. almost got his head shaved quickly in there. Tag mate, here comes Tim of Too Cool 2. Hey, reversal into the ropes. He throws him in. He ducked him, comes back. Whoa, but he Whoa. can't get this big monster down. Drop kick. Now to get him down like a ton of bricks. When the Soul Taker drops, you One can of them. It. Whoa, and Soul Taker throws him up high. And Richard out there sticking his two cents in it over there, Brian. Tag made. Here comes Flex of Too Cool 2. Boy, some pretty interesting words from Grady Watson out here. The fan, he, he's a little hot under the collar, too, wasn't he? Isn't he, though? I don't blame him a bit and his whole family down in Mississippi. No, I don't blame him. They're a great family. I know I don't blame him one I own. If somebody was fooling with my kids and family, I'd be hot about it, too. Oh, that's a fact. Well, you want to get under a man's collar, you start fooling with his family. Listening to Grady, I don't think that's over by a long shot. Coco, beware. Whoa. Came in and just jabbed him right in the eye that time. How would Coco look without his hair? I don't know. Oh, he's got Coco! Oh, look out. He's trying to get he gets him down! A one down! A two! Oh, and we almost lost that natural from Woo. Coco Beware that time. Oh. That he's out here riding and raving about. He's got a bunch of BBs in that natural too, Brian, if you know what I mean. I he, guarantee he you that. Really he probably needs a head shaving. It'll do him good. He was worried about that. And he should be. Fans chanting for flex. And Coco runs in, nobody home. I don't know if you could hear that. He really cream, got cream into the turnbuckle. Fans chanting, let's go flex, let's go. And Rashard doesn't like it. He's trying to get everybody to be quiet over there so he can concentrate. Look at flex. Pounding away on Coco. Boy, he is just getting a beating over here. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Coco pushes him down. But I think he caught him right below the belt, Brian, now before he Soul did Taker that. was over here interfering. Tag made it out. He says, hey, Rashard, come on and get you some. Yeah, R Rashard is always there when there's no trouble. He can try to finish things up. Oh, That's Rashard. about all he's good for right there. That's about his the length, extent of his talent right there. And out on the floor he goes. That That's bottom's a little sore. Absurd, yeah. Flex. Oh, he runs up Coco. Oh, oh, look at that. One. Two, I can hear the clip. Oh, oh, no. And the referee he gets out of it. Boy, he sure had him rolled up in he a small sure package. Good move from Flex. And Coco able to kick out of it after the two count. Two is all he got that time. Into the ropes now. And they go after the bird man. Now he goes in the middle of the ring. And Soul Taker jumps in there and can't help break that. They couldn't cut Jerry Callahan really has his hands full with this match. There's a lot to watch here. Yeah, you're looking at five guys in there. A lot to keep track of. Oh, look at Tim. He was going for a monkey flip. Oh, and he finally gathers his foot in there. Goes back up. Flips Coco Beware over. Big right oh. hand down on Coco and down he goes. Out on the floor he is. Oh, he's mad. Look at Coco. I think Coco's seen the writing on the wall here. He doesn't want to hear the sound of those clippers. <laughs> uh, hair match this Saturday morning. What's sound that sound like? like? Let's hear that clipper. That's the sound of those clippers warming up over here right oh, at ringside. Yeah. We've got them right here at ringside. And I tell you what, we're going to have to get him ready here in just a few moments. Oh, look at short holding him. He's holding his, yeah, you see Rashad reaching through the rose holder while Coco and the Soul Taker work over Tim now, that too cool too. We're going to keep our cameras rolling right here, fans. We're going to have to take a quick, quick break, a two-minute break. While we're out for the break, those of you that are home watching, if anything happens, we'll certainly come back on the other side and we'll be able to show it to you. Stay right there. Don't go anywhere because today it's hair versus hair. 
There must be a winner. We'll keep our cameras rolling. We'll be right back on the other side. K97, your station for Mike Evans and the early morning team. Devin Steele in the afternoons and continuous jams all day. Let your head K97, number one for hip-hop and R&B. Turn us on now. Here is your last chance to beat the heat this summer with a new backyard pool. And for a limited time, Blue World Pools has that cool pool you've been dreaming of. Completely installed on your ready site for only $2.99. Incredible! Just $2.99. Yes, and that price will include pump, filter, liner, ladder, a free winter cover, and a free solar blanket. It all for just $2.99. Wow! This is your last chance. The savings won't get any better. So call now. Want even more? Then you want the classic model from Blue World Pools. It's our top-of-the-line pool. High on style, low on maintenance, and unmatched for beauty and enjoyability. Everyone loves a pool. Just think of the family fun you'll have splashing and playing with the kids, partying with your friends, not only the rest of this summer, but for every summer to come. But it's your last chance on a limited-time offer to put that dream pool in your backyard. The price will never be better. Call Blue World Pools now. Homeowners only, please. Uh, here we are back on the air now. Coco was pulling something out of his tights. I don't know what it was over there. Oh, and he just chapped him. Oh, look at Rashard. Rashard. That's Coco sticking it back in. Meanwhile, look at Rashard over here. Rashard had a rope. Here he is back again. Coco's got that piece of rope now. That's the chain he's got. Oh, he's choking him with it. I'm going to tell you, we're not careful. 2 q 2 is going to wind up losing a hair out here, trying to watch all three of these guys and bringing all this stuff they're bringing out here. Corey Macklin, Brian Tacklin right here at ringside with us. Calling all the action here today on Memphis Wrestling. This one goes to the expiration of our time here today. And the loser loses their hair right yeah, here today. Yeah, buddy, it's going to happen. It wasn't planned when we got here today, but I'm looking forward to this. Ah, right, look at Rashard. Kinging away on him. Whoa! He goes to drop the elbow and misses it out on the floor, he goes. Another nice wrestling move by Rashard. Yeah, and Rashard. Elbow under the mat. Oh, look at Coco. Coco he just popped him with that chain. What do you got? How do you get rid of that chain, Coco? Coco beware with a big chain wrapped around his fist. Rashard with a pin. That's a one count, and one's all he's able to get. Man, oh, man. We need about three referees in there to watch everything on this match. Soul Taker. Soul Taker backs him into the turnbuckle. Across the way, he whips him hard. And the Soul Taker runs in with all 400-plus oh, oh. pounds, man. That'll knock the wind out. Just imagine a big meat truck running after no, you, Brian. That's what it's it. about like. Man, oh, man. Trying Soul to, Taker. Trying to get him over to Coco. Had that chain earlier. There's a tag. Rashard is over there. What? Calhoun has got to turn around and see what's going on here. Yeah, Richard, you were doing nothing over there. Mr. Mr. Innocence. Fans chanting, go, Tim, go. It's too good, too. Boy, not looking. They're not fair too good against these three guys right now. I'm telling you. Uh, Richard's got a problem with the crowd here. You it's better look a tough at the hold this whole deal to see who will get their head shaved right here today on Memphis Wrestling. Live on TV, we're bringing it to you right in your living room. Someone will get their head shaved today, Brian. Togo just got the joke on over there. Boy, look at this. Trying to get a tag here. 
Calhoun says, Richard, get out of the ring. Hey, Richard. We got a match over there. Soul Taker whips him in hard. Does Coco Soul Taker. How do you he go? Flying past this. Can this do it? That could be it right there. Soul Taker pounds down on him and breaks the pin. As Tim had him pinned, boy, he, really he had did. him going. He did. Man, oh, man. Big shoulder oh. and down and both out. Uh-oh. That was a... Uh, what a oh, collision. Oh, man. Van Sheeran, go, Tim, go. I think it's whoever can get up here. Whoever can come to their senses first. Coco Beware and Tim of Too Cool, Too Out. That wasn't good for anybody. We got both of them out. Referee Jerry Calhoun County. Van Sheeran for Too Cool, Too. a tag here. He needs a tag, and he needs it badly, my friend. Let me tell you. Coco gets the tag on Solitaire, okay. and here goes Flexin! Look at Flex go! Boy, he's doing... Oh, he, he kicks Coco oh. out on the floor, he goes! Says, get out of the ring, and Coco... And they both got the Solitaire in there! And look at Richard for mine, oh my goodness! A double whammy as he catches both of them below the belt! The only way he knows man, how to wrestle. Man, oh man, right below the belt. And Soul Taker going for that choke slam. This could do it. Look at this. Too good, too. About to lose that hair in here, looks like. <laughs> Meanwhile, Rashad on the bragging to the fans. And now they got oh. Rashad Duvall. Oh, my. Rashad. Rashad doesn't have a clue. He turns around. Look at that. One, two. That's it. It's all over TV. You are not the father. And it happens every day in the Mid-South. I have the results of the, the DNA test. When there's the slightest doubt, there are paternity tests. So who's taking them? Friends, neighbors, even your spouse. And you might not even know it. Eyewitness News uncovers the secret world of paternity tests. I was nervous, I was sweating, and I almost cried. Who is your daddy? Monday night at 9 on EPM 30. Rocks like Rock 103. 103. Wake up who in the morning? Classic rock all day. Rock 103. Inventor, do you have an invention? Invention Submission Corporation has free information to help you. ISC is America's largest inventor service firm. Call and learn how to try to submit your idea to industry through ISC's data bank and apply for a patent. Also learn about our virtual invention prototype service. Even if your idea is just to improve an existing product, call for ISC's information. For your inventor's information, call 1-800-982-5070. Get your daily dose of Fear Factor. Weekdays at 3 on UPN 30. That was the craziest stuff I've ever done. Here we go, back on Memphis Wrestling. And I'm going to take no need for these guards. We don't... Here he is. Yeah, they finally got him. Let's get him out of here. You set him right here. Let's get him. Come on, Rashad. He's kicking and screaming like a... Like a... Some wild animal or something, Brian. He doesn't want this. Come on, send him right here. Come on, let's go. Get him up here. Get him up here. Here we go, we found him. We gotta get a good shot of this. Oh, he's, oh, he's. <laughs> 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 Richard, 
Didn't know it was haircut day when he came in today. He's going out a little lighter. He didn't have a clue. He was in the ring, making fun of everyone, chanting to the crowd. Did not see this coming. This was actually his idea when we had the card set for today. We didn't have a hair match. Then Richard started opening his mouth. And this is what happens today. Crowd up at ringside here watching this. It's kind of rare on a Saturday morning. We see this uh, once in a while in the, in the Coliseum on our matches on a Saturday morning. Yeah, yeah this adds a little something to it. Oh, yeah. Richard doesn't look like a happy person. <laughs> he just doesn't look very happy, but we'll see what kind of look he's got. Corey, I didn't know you were so good with the Clippers. I think Corey Macklin... Uh, Went to barber school on the side here sometime when he was younger. He's pretty good with that clipper. Poor Richard. We'll see what kind of look this is. Look at this. Corey, Corey Macklin may be going into business on the side. You need a little trim. Corey's your man. He looks like an expert in there. Incredible. Happy head. Happy head. And the crowd right up here at ringside. Don't hurt him now. Be good with. Let's see what he looks like here, Corey. Let's, yeah, I tell let's you. Get a look here. He needs. He should have got a haircut before he got here. It's yeah. hard to get this hair off. Let's see how he looks. He's got a few BBs in here, I think, Brian. Here you go, guys. You guys help us. Come on, two cool. Yeah. Get the rest let of every, it. Let everybody get a shot. We'll finish him up. We're out of time okay. now, I think. But we'll make sure he's clean as an onion come oh, next yeah. week. I guarantee you that. Let's get some of the fans to help us with this. Come on and help us. Everybody We're out of time. See you next week. Bye-bye, everybody. This wrestling brought to you by Country Ford and by Cash Depot. Brad Pitt stars in a comedy about falling in love with the right person. Oh, <laughs> the favor. Saturday at noon on UPN 30. She turned in front of me and just stopped. And I got rear-ended at 90 miles an hour and it told me. They ran the red light and hit me head on. We know car wrecks and how to help you. The insurance company was really rude, didn't even care. They really didn't want too much to hear what I had to say. The insurance company basically was ignoring my claim. I want you to feel like it's the best call you've ever made. I got probably uh, twice as what I expected from him. He put a big smile on my face when I saw the check. I think Corby Trotz has his job down pat. <laughs> Deal. Right now at Country Ford, fresh shipments of 04 and 05 Ford certified pre-owned cars and trucks are rolling in. Plus, Country Ford is now your Mercury certified pre-owned headquarters. Prices slashed to below market levels. Credit problems? No problem. But don't wait. See us now while selection's best. Whatever it takes. You just can't beat a country-made deal anywhere. Having trust issues? It could get worse. You knew better. Feel better. Watch the Jerry Springer Show weekdays at noon on UPN 30. Coming up next on the UPN Hot Weekend Movie. Brad Pitt stars <gasps> in a comedy about falling in love with the right person. Holy mother! The favor. <laughs>